This is going to be the most challenging series I think I've ever done. Welcome to the first episode of the Harrogate Town career mode series. Yo, first things first, getting all the stadium stuff sorted. Got the real stadium name, the N. Vito Vent Stadium. That's where we're going to be playing in the fourth division of English football. Yes, lads, it's time to revive my second channel, which I haven't uploaded on in so freaking long. I know you guys are wondering, where's Play Career Mode? What happened to Cidinho? Guys, Play Career Mode is ass on FIFA 22. Let's be real. What did he say? <laughs> I love career mode, so I thought, you know what? If I want to revive the second channel, let's do something different on there. And Harrogate Town, RTG, I haven't ever done a series like this on the main channel. The second channel seems perfect for it. We're going to run this series, though, in a bit of a different way. Instead of my usual career mode episodes, these are going to be 8 to 12 minutes long. Um, we're going to also have a lot of footage, a lot of content in every episode. It's going to be faster paced, so we can get through seasons. A different approach, and let's see how this goes. All right, but first things first, got to get through the squad and see the legends we'll be working with but none of these are legends let's be real striker options we've got mr armstrong who's 24 not too bad he's quick decent physicals yo he might be here for a while muldoon he is 32 yeah he's got 80 pace though he's quick we've got diamond wow what a name what a freaking name 21 as well yo these young players keep an eye out on them patterson is pretty young too falkingham is old but that's fine that's 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 fine yo why do we have a 58 rated player in right mid oh bring on the power what a name what a name 88 pace 23 years old the irishman Thompson could actually play there. What's his age? Oh, he's 29. I'd rather put power in there. We'll put this right back in here. He's 25. We've got Leggett, center back. Oh, 33 pace. I just, I'm probably quicker than him. Boom. Roasted. We've got Burrell, who's actually a right back. So I'll put him there and put a center back in. Oh my God. The combined pace of our two center backs is 67. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Burrell alone is quicker than these two. Oh my days. Well, our left back's fairly quick. Ah, striker doesn't even have a face. That's not a good sign. Beck's better than him. We'll put him there. Wow, we literally have Kirby in our team. You guys know Kirby? The pink um, thing from Nintendo? Guys, I wasn't kidding when I said this career mode's gonna be a challenge. Oh my days, we've got £50,000 as our transfer budget and about 17000 in wage budget. Yeah, that brother's starving. This is uncharted territory for me. I'm never used to having this less money. Like, no, 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 This, this is uncharted territory. Yes, development plans. And, of course, Youth Academy is the only way to sort this team out. Everybody's on, like, a one-year deal as well. Good lord, what have I gotten myself into? Really can't think of any player we're signing with this sort of a budget. Guess all of our money needs to go in our academy. Good thing is, a homegrown player actually looks decent. 69-rated Blake Bolton. He's already the best player in our team he's 16 we can't promote him that's a good sign he's got 81 shooting what yo i'm making him a striker i'm making him a striker it'll take 30 weeks though yikes he is born to be a striker man honestly but we're gonna promote him we're gonna promote him gonna make him a striker and just put him up there he he is made for it remember the name boys blake bolton remember the name he is gonna be the man for us blake bolton you absolute legend oh Oh my god, he's literally our best player already at the age of 16. We're gonna build the team around him. But there is no money to build anything. <laughs> what have I gotten myself into? What do we do with this money? Honestly, man, what even are these transfer offers? 50,000 for a player. Like, what are we doing here? Wow. I'm sorry, Kirby. You got no face. I'm putting you on the transfer transfer list. No face, and you're not getting in my team, man. That's, that's just an accepted rule. I don't care if you've got potential or what. I prefer really not to... Um not to speak. Yo, this is some sort of a joke. We've just received a transfer offer of zero pounds. I've never seen that. What is happening here? Like, honestly, do we literally just let him go? Pretty sure he's part of our team. Like, yeah. Haven't really had a time to dwell into transfers because, well, we've barely got any money. We've upped our transfer budget a bit to 200,000, but I don't know what to do with it. So, we're going to be playing a game and just introducing ourselves to the EFL League 2. I don't know what to expect and Rochdale are playing a 5 at the back. Anyways, let's see who are the top players of this team. Oh, there is a new story to be told. My first ever career mode all the way down from the EFL League 2. I'm ready for this challenge. Come on. Oh boy. I'm I'm scared. Blake Bolton FC boys. We need to give him number 10. We'll do that after this game. 
Get his shot off. There you go. And the ref's not giving it. It's the League 2, boys. There's no VAR or anything. It's whatever happens, happens. Oh, can I just say the players feel so slow and laggy? It's probably how they're intended to play like, but whatever. The guy was Mr. Forking him, our captain. Look at the space out wide, and we might have a chance here early on. It's power. Does he have the power? I'm going to go for the cross. Bolton controls that one well. Goes for goal and almost scored our first ever goal. Oh, I'm not a fan of this. It's a chance for Rochdale. Please, no, please, no. Come on. I didn't know they could score acrobatic efforts in, in League 2. That, that, that caught me by surprise. 1 0. Yes, Diamond. Go on, Diamond. He's going nowhere. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're going to concede again. No, this page guy saved us there. Guys, it's it's not that difficult. Get the ball to, to Bolton and, he, and he'll save us. That's the only way. Here we go, boys. Here we go. I see Blake making that run. That pass was so bad. These guys can't pass. He was literally going to be 1v1 versus the keeper. And he couldn't play that ball through properly. Oh, no. Oh, no. They're going to score again. They're going to score again. Our keeper, 61 rated, actually made a save. Oh, Blake Bolton, this is your moment. This is your moment. Go on. Come on, dude. You're play Oh, come on. He got two chances there. Power, come on. You've got the power, mate. You've got the power. Come on, head it down. Head it down. Bolton, no. Addison, we still have it. We still have it, but I don't know what to do with it. So we're going to go back there. Pass inside for Armstrong. He's looking quick. Oh, decent position. The keeper just stood there and he managed to make the save. You're kidding me? Oh, we're getting ripped apart here for pace. This Odo guy is quick. He's going to go for the cutback. And it's 2-0. Guys, we're going to struggle a lot in this save. Huh. For the first time ever, I'm going to be experiencing the pain of EFL League 2. If you guys are enjoying watching this pain, this struggle, I'd appreciate it. Spare a second and drop a like in the video. Subscribe if you're new around here on this second channel. Because I'm going to try and make this series as consistently as possible. And I need your guys' support for that. And I also need moral support because... We're getting outplayed by Rochdale here, and uh, it's it's no fun. Oh, they've got another chance here. We're lucky to not concede again. This is looking very positive. This is looking very positive. Blake Bolton. Oh, no, he couldn't get there first. There we go, Mr. Patterson. He's on it. He's on it here. He's on it. Try something. Why? Just, just why? At this point, I just want to score a goal. I if I score a goal, I'll be a happy man. But yeah, that's not happening. Instead, we're getting taken out like that. Well, this was not a good start. I've just realized this team is terrible and there is a lot of work to do. Guess investing in the Youth Academy is the only way to survive, boys. And we're going to have to work on it. We're going to have to work on it. I guess I'm going to be wrapping up this episode right here. And I don't know how we're going to save this team. Well, maybe I've got an idea. Free agents. Well, we'll keep that for the next episode. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.